Hello my beautiful angels, it is me, Holy Tony, and on today's episode of Cooking with Holy Tony, we will actually be baking Easy Cheese Tea Biscuits. Okay my beautiful angels, before we start, let's tie our hair back, wash our hands, and sanitize our area. Because of my bangs, I don't like the hair in my face, so I'm gonna take a hairband and slick my hair back with it. Now that we've slicked our hair back, tied our hair back, let's sanitize our surface. sanitize the surface let's wash our hands for our ingredients you want two cups of all-purpose flour one tablespoon of baking powder one teaspoon of salt one fourth cup of butter room temperature one and a half cups of grated cheddar cheese and one cup whole milk plus a tablespoon for brushing the biscuits afterwards in addition to the equipment seen in the previous photo, you will need scissors, a fork, a whisk, a spatula, a pastry brush, a cookie cutter, cooking grease or parchment paper, a bowl to mix your ingredients in, a baking sheet, and oven mitts. Here I am adding two cups of all-purpose flour to the bowl and using a knife to level off any excess flour. A small spill of flour occurred so I quickly cleaned it up. I'm washing the dry measuring cups so it can be used later when grating the cheese. Now I'm adding the baking powder and salt and using a whisk to mix it together. Then I measured 1 fourth of a cup of butter and placed it in the microwave for 10 to 15 seconds so it would be room temperature and easier to mix. I am going ahead with my fork and my fingers to combine the butter with the flour until the mixture is coarse and sandy. I quickly washed my hands and placed the mixture in the freezer for 30 minutes and preheated my oven to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay Google, set an alarm for 30 minutes. I quickly cleaned up my area and went to go wash my hands before I grated the cheese. Here I'm using the scissors to cut open the block of cheese and grating in a downwards motion. As I'm grating, I'm putting the cheese into the dry measuring cup to make sure I don't overgrate. I place the scissors and grater in the sink and place the leftover cheese back in the fridge. Here I'm washing my dishes, drying them and placing them back as well as sanitizing my surface. I'm taking the flour mixture out of the freezer and adding the grated cheese and milk and using a fork to combine. I'm turning the dough out onto a floured work surface and working fast so the butter doesn't warm up. Picking my cookie cutter, I'm cutting the dough into mini round biscuits and using my cooking grease, I'm spraying it onto my baking sheet. Taking my pastry brush and brushing milk onto each biscuit and placing it in the oven for 15 minutes. Set an alarm for 15 minutes. Now I'm cleaning up my area, putting my ingredients back where they belong, and washing my dishes. I'm putting on my oven mitts and taking my biscuits out of the oven and placing it on a cooling rack to cool for 10 minutes. This is the final product and holy they look good! Don't forget to turn off the oven! Set an alarm for 10 minutes. As I'm waiting for my biscuits to cool, I'm going to wash my dishes, sanitize my area, and sweep the floor. Time to wash these hands and taste these biscuits. Okay, now we're going to try one of them. Okay, let's see how they taste. Holy, that is good. Holy, holy, holy. 10 out of 10. Goodbye, my beautiful angels. I will see you soon. In the meantime, have a great day and stay holy. <laughs>